Yeah. So do you think he's still really getting surgery? He, he if he wants to get surgery, that's his that's his life, that's his hand or his shoulders, that's his business. He's how old? You can't control him, man. If he wants to get it, let him get it. Like, do you understand? Cause like it's, damn, this is really weird. Cause like how we got into a fight is I, t- I was telling him how he didn't have to go get surgery. How he just needs some like physical therapy. Like if he would go get some massage and stuff. Leave this man alone. You have your life to live. You should, you should. You, if he feels that is what is good for him, the same way you have your beliefs. No one can impose any other thing on you. You already. So if he's made up his mind that, that that this is what he wants to do, I think this is what he ha- wants to do. So he just wants to have surgery. He wants people to feel bad. Like I don't understand. No, but beyond the surgery, there's something wrong because I asked him the other day that, okay, go to the hospital when he was he was <sighs> he couldn't he yeah, was working. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I said go to the hospital, and he's like they can't do anything. They can't. And I'm like, there's something he's not saying. Yeah. And his friends will come in and he will take them to the room, lock the door. And I know. St- stop it. I know. He, you're right. He's been bringing a lot of old friends over a lot lately. Oh, you know, you noticed that? Yeah. Like he's been uh, like exactly people he used to be friends with like years ago. Um, about like six months ago, he had me drive like four hours to go meet with an old friend of his no, I don't just to have dinner. And the guy like didn't even show up. It was so weird. So weird. I don't know, man. You're right, though. You're right. I haven't been thinking about it like yeah, that. Yeah, but I think... I've been, say, I've been opposite. I've been like you, except He said the, dr- the drugs is... I've been saying something wrong with him upstairs, is what no. I thought. Like, he's got memory problems, or like he's getting old, or he's got stories confused, or he's like... I think it, the drugs that he's taking, he said, is affecting him. You think marijuana is affecting him like that? Because... No, not drugs. Like the drugs he used for hepatitis. Oh, you so you think the prescription drugs are fucking him up? Yeah. That would make sense because you're right. He's giving himself injections. He's taking daily medications. He told me the drugs he used for the hepatitis. That's the effect. That is working. I think he's working against him I right now. I don't believe it. I'm gonna call my dad to be honest. Or like I can call a doctor. Even. Yeah, but like, I don't know. You know what? Just that's why I said listen to what he has to say. Me, I really, I'm, I'm just a passerby. You know what they call passerby? <laughs> I'm going <laughs> any moment I could be gone, and even if I stay, definitely I'm going back to my country. Do you understand? At some point. So. Um, I heard you're flying on your own now. Yeah, yeah. Fuck yeah. Yeah, I. Fuck I, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So. Hey. Is it true you drew, you flew a plane at nighttime a few nights ago? Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. Once the sun goes down. Yeah. What's that like? Yeah, god. It's beautiful, like. You know. Oh my god! By yourself, I'd cry. Yeah. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah. So. Yeah, I saw you leaving. I was like, she, because I saw you in your uniform. I was like, is she going to fly right now? Yeah. I was blown yeah. away. I was supposed to do that yesterday night. But, no way. Oh, but man. The way, I so, like, do you have to put in the X amount of hours at nighttime and then X amount of hours in the day? Yeah, I needed yeah. So, I needed some nighttime hours. I wow. was supposed to go to Atlanta yesterday at night, but the weather along the route was not looking good. Dude, I'm so glad I met you, to be honest. I've never met, like, a fucking girl pilot and, like... Yeah, so, yeah, uh, so let's, let's just listen to what he has to say. Be nice, I think, and look at him. Look closely at Dennis. Dennis has lost crazy weight. It's not about You're right, you're right. Look closely. I thought and, it was coming Do you know out. and I told him and I asked him, so why are you losing weight? Do you know what he said? What do you say? He can't eat. That he's been that's why he's been smoking weed so that he would weed gives him appetite. Is it true? Yeah. Weed does give you appetite. He said but he can't eat. That's why he's been smoking a lot of weed to see if he can eat but he cannot eat. He just is sick. So you just acting up at him. That guy is sick. I don't know what is there's something wrong somewhere. So just understand. Yeah. Do you get just try and I don't know. Because yesterday I was You're like, trying to say just try and understand him. Like, just try and listen to him. Maybe if he's giving you this place is a good deal. I know me and you were not friends and I, I have to go. Do you understand? And really I really don't care. 
I don't. I know. That's why I it's funny. Because if I were to be bothered about it, I would I wouldn't even want to talk about the deal so that you don't get to see it. But at the end of the day, I could always get a place currently, and I'm not looking for a whole house. I'm just looking for a room, so I could always get a place. But, but, that guy. Trust me, there's something wrong with that one. Uh, like I'm just like. Mm. So just just sit with him and listen to what he has to say. Do you understand? He told me, oh, you don't have to move ending of the month. I think, and you, he wanted both of you to share the rent together, is it? He told you, you mm -hmm. guys, you pay half the rent, he pays half the rent, or he brings in somebody else. Oh, yeah, for, yeah. He wanted me to pay for your room, but I wasn't willing to buy your room unless the bed is out. Like, because I need space. I yeah. do need space, but like, why am I gonna like? I don't need the bed. Yeah, and but, he doesn't want to get rid of the bed. But if you if you pay for my room, that's how much he's offering you. That exactly is how much the whole place is. Exactly. Yeah, I'm not stupid. Yeah. Like, I'm not gonna impulsively like exactly. If I had to move out today, I would, and I could. I don't have to. I I could go be the hotel for a month. Yeah. You, know? you inspired me of that. You know, like you can do. Why can't I can do it. Yeah, yeah, but I was I was at the hotel. Do you understand? But that's it's from the hotel I came here. I know. So I, I'm just saying to you, like, just, uh, I don't know, listen to what he has to say. I think there's something wrong down the line. And I think as the, I don't know, I think there's something wrong. There's something wrong with him medically, medically. There's something wrong with him. Because the way he and his friends go into the room, they talk. It's like he's trying to sell us stuff. Well, even um, the person that I had over here yesterday, the kid Scott, he brought Scott into his room and gave him like three books. You a stranger. He, exactly. He gave me three stuff yesterday. He has never given me. Should I show you? Like, shush. And I'm like, bro, is this man allowed? I even sent a message to my friend. I'm scared. He gave, he gave me a bag. You know, he gave me, then his friends, uh, one guy came on, and I think he's been giving the guy, because I don't know, he gave the guy some other stuff. So, sis, there's something wrong. For somebody to say that the effect of the drug is affecting him, the drug, I think he took a very strong drug, not the $800 drug. So you think he took something else? I think he took something very strong, and he said, the, that the effect is affected. That means he has gone to the hospital and he told him that's what is wrong with him. And because I said go to the hospital and he's like, there's nothing they can do anymore. Like, yeah. And he has lost weight. S on that two weeks, when he walks, just just look at him. I know. I remember he actually he used to be really big. Yeah. Had a big belly. He just had to get rid of a bunch of clothes because he doesn't fit them anymore. Yeah, he has, I looked at him and the guy is, if he continues like this, after one month, it, he will look really sick. So just be nice and hear what he has to say. That's all I'm saying. You don't have to fight him or tell him, get the fuck out. You don't. And tomorrow he dies and you feel bad. That would be your case. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's all I have to say. We don't have to be friends tomorrow or after this conversation. We don't have to be friends, but, you know, it is what it is. Me, I'm going to school to sign in and I'll be back because I don't have to pay. I'll just sign in there. In the night when I'm going to fly, I'll sign out because, what's that? Just the fridge. <laughs>